send attractive undergraduates out to talk to other undergraduates to offer sexual access. Say, well, you know, would you be willing to have coffee with me? Would you be willing to give me your phone number? Would you be willing to come back to my apartment? If the girls offer that, then whoever they're offering that to on the male front will take them up on their offer. But if the boys offer that, even when they're attractive, the probability that their advances will be rejected is extremely high. And so young men face the uncomfortable situation where even if they're competent and will turn eventually into useful men, um, which isn't the status of most very young men, the probability that they'll be rejected is extremely high. And then it's also the case that there's little that's more psychologically impactful than such rejection, especially if it's undertaken by someone to whom there's a genuine attraction. 